Trainer Eddie Futch said he wanted Montel Griffin to conduct this fight in wide circles around the outside of the ring. Keep moving James Tony laterally so that he can't set his feet. And that's exactly what he should be doing now. Good all. He can counter, he can lead, he's a hard puncher when he's right. So and he's waiting for Mattel, Montel as though Montel has it and get off balance. But that was back, and he's just sitting there right hand and nothing else. Straight left. Griffin moving more and more toward his right. Away. Staying upstairs with the jab in this round. Now he goes back down to the body, and Griffin counters over it with a left hand. George, that's good for Tony, right? I think that's good for any fighter who want to really maintain you. You're taller, use that jab. Whenever he throws that jab, this Tony just doesn't seem to function on that left side for that step. That's a good point. There he goes. Fight for Tony on February 18, 1995 as well. And, and you... Then it's another fight. Montel has got...